Hello everyone. In this video, we will see how can we make choice field as searchable in ServiceNow. So you might be using choice field or the select box in your ServiceNow, which might have a very, very long list of choices. And then it becomes very difficult for people to scroll down and search for their required option. So ServiceNow has a functionality to add an attribute to these choice field or select fields, which we will see in a minute where you can just type in the search query and you would be presented with all the options there. Let's quickly jump to ServiceNow and see that. Also, if you are liking my content, please do subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit that like button. I'm on my incident screen and I have created a field called type of devices. So this is a custom field. And if I click on this choice, you will see there are around 10 options here. But in a real case, there might be 100, 200 choices which the user can be presented with. So what you can do in that case is introduce a search option here where the user can easily search between all the choices and it will become very easy for him to select the option he wants to rather than scrolling. So what we will do is we will right click on this field and go into configure dictionary. And if I scroll down a bit, I will click on advanced view under related links. And once the advanced view comes up, we will see an attribute field here and we will type here is searchable choice equals to true. So that means we will give a searchable choice to the user and I will update this. And now if I click on this drop down, I would be presented with a search option here and maybe I can type server and all the choices which have server in their options will be presented here. For example, if now I type Unix, only the option which has Unix keyword will come up here. Let's test this also on the service catalog, whether this option works on catalogs or not. For that, I will go to maintain catalog or maintain items actually and when I go into maintain items, I will click on this test one. This is a catalog item which I have already created. And if I scroll down at the bottom, I have two variables and one of them is select box and the name of the location. So this is a select box and I have chosen here the table called CMN underscore location, which is out of the box table. I will quickly show you that as well under type specifications and the choice field is name. And if I scroll down a bit again, you would see variable attributes. So I will paste the same attribute here is searchable choice equals to true. And let's see if this works on the variables as well or not. I will click on try it. And when I click on name of location, I'm again presented with the search options here. Right now there is no data, unfortunately, but if you would have data in there, you would be presented with search options. And again, you can use it the same way you were using on the incident form. I hope this video was helpful to you and you have learned something new and please subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit that like button and let me know in comments if you have any questions or any suggestions on topics which I should be making video. Thank you.